we are sharing the tiniest little bench. Hi. <laughs> I wish my butt, butt weren't so big. <laughs> um, guys, we are so excited to sit down and give you guys another house update. We have so many things we want to talk about in this video and in the next video to come. Today we are going to be talking about us meeting with the finishing guy and what he does is closets, cupboards, any, desks, yeah. cabinets, anything. So he is going to be, when you walk into our home, there is a little mudroom area from the garage where you take your shoes off, it leads you into the laundry room, that's called a mudroom. And he, we are going to have him build us a little bench in there and then in Jared's office. Yeah, he, what I'm thinking, I'm kind of building it in my mind right now, but I want him to build me a really nice like L-shaped desk and um, some paneling for my guitars to hang them on the wall. So on the wall there will be like sections of panels that he can put his guitars in. And it'll look so cool. I'm excited. The, <laughs> the plans look really cool. Maybe we could insert that too. Yeah. Downstairs we will have a little filming area and on one of the um, full walls, I want him to build us shelves that don't go to the ceiling that are just like half wall shelves just so we can open them up, throw lights, cameras, equipment, um, just anything for our filming in those shelves. Yeah, we also want to put like a little outlet inside of there so we can have a charging station. Make sure this camera is always charged because sometimes we forget. And then for our closet, we decided to take out some of the shelving in there because it is quite large and put a little vanity in there. So he's going to build me just a little simple shelf vanity so that I can sit and do my makeup and so I'm very excited for that. Ellie loves sitting at this vanity that we got her for from Bed Bath & mm -hmm, Beyond mm -hmm. so I'm really excited to have a vanity built into the closet where you can like sit down and do your makeup and everything. The very last thing that our finishing guy is going to be doing for us is the banister. Yes. That is what I am probably most excited about is I just I love how our stairway is and how it looks and I've been very excited for the banister. I keep spitting, sorry. Well the thing that I remember most about like seeing the plan and walking through uh, our friend's house who we designed the plan after, the very first time we walked through you fell in love with the staircase mm -hmm. and you wanted this to be it's like beautiful. a very prominent part of the house. The style of these pictures go well with the style of our home. Nice stained banisters with the white uh, balusters the white poles, I guess yeah. you could call them. So that is what we had been seeing. And then our interior designer sent us this photo that was stunning. It blew me away. I want something a little bit different and a little bit unique for our staircase. We took this picture to our framing guy and showed him what we had in mind. And just like being a hairstylist, people coming in saying they want Jennifer Aniston's hair or, you know, they want to look like um, Who's someone the guy else. from One Direction with the long hair? You know, they want that. It's like you have to be realistic as well. <laughs> and so, you know, sometimes, you know, pictures that you bring to people may not be up to code. You know, the, the guy basically said you have to be careful with Pinterest because sometimes those things aren't up to code and they can't actually do that. So we constructed our own little banister. I'm probably the best drawer that I you know. You really are. It looks and good. I, and I drew this up kind of as an idea of what we could do and the the finishing guy said, yeah, I can make that. Yeah, so he pretty much is going to do what we want, so it will be kind of slated and go down. Um, but Jared designed the, what is this called? This is the banister. The newel post? Or the, the sorry, this is the pillar. I think it's called the newel post. I have no idea. We both don't know the terms. I the call big, it the pillar. The, the big pillar. Jared designed that, and I think that it was beautiful. Very simple. Like I said, I'm probably the best <laughs> artist that I know. The next thing that we picked out and designed was actually from the cabinet guys. It was the mantle for our fireplaces. I'm really excited about that, too. Like, like everything that we've done, we've kind of set with a theme and everything follows that and the very crisp nice lines the transitional 
um, style is what we're after and I think this mantle does a really good job at sticking to that. The past couple of weeks have been very exciting for us, but they also have been a little bit stressful, which keeps us on our toes, which I think is a good thing. Yes. We definitely have been thinking that we have a little bit more time, but our builder called us and said, hey, we're actually a little bit ahead of schedule. A little bit. Compared to what we initially <laughs> thought. So that means we have less time. So we're like jumping at our feet, trying we to get everything done. We thought we were done. doing really good. We're like, mm -hmm. we have so much picked out. And then they're like, okay, well, what about the fireplace? And this uh, and this and this and this. Tile. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> I had to pick that out. It's like everything. So we've been a little bit um, flustered at times, but it's exciting at the same time. It's kind of like a pregnancy. Yeah, it kind of just sneaks up on you, but we're so excited. We can't wait for everything else that's coming. We can't wait to solidify everything else. Honestly, after today, I feel like we're just about done. Like yeah. that's what I feel like, but we're gonna be surprised with something else, I'm I sure. know it. So with the finishing guy, we met with him, we talked about what we wanted, kind of designed a few things, but here in a few weeks, he will actually come to our house and sketch up like the vanity, the mud room, the shelving, and kind of give me a better idea of what will, how it will be and what it will look like. Right. So I'm really excited for that as well. So that is our little update for you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for our next video that will be about baths, bathtubs, fixtures, a whole lot of other things. Stuff that we enjoy so, so much. Toilets. Toilets. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Flash. Oh, Thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you in our next video. Bye, Bye. guys.